हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज रजय गुप्ता आई एम फ्रॉम फैकल्टी ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड टेक्नोलॉजी यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ लखनऊ एंड आई एम गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट अ सेमिनार ऑन बैक्टीरियल कंक्रीट फर्स्ट इज इंट्रोडक्शन एज वी ऑल नो कंक्रीट इज मोस्ट वाइडली यूज्ड मटेरियल फॉर कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड इट इज ऑल्सो इन वीक इन टेंशन एंड कॉन्क्रीट कैकिंग ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट इज अ मेन कंसर्न बिकॉज इट कॉज लॉस ऑफ स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर विद टाइम maintenance of cracked structure require a lot of care and money a uh, environmental friendly solution is preferred that is bacterial concrete over other alternative like epoxy injection which is non degradable what is bio concrete it is a special type of concrete invented by a group of microbiology researchers under the head of hank junkers bio concrete is also called bacterial concrete or self healing concrete it's especially made to increase the life span or durability of uh, concrete structure by the self healing action of that concrete there's in figure number 1 that is shows the bacterial concrete next is what is special found in concrete <coughs> there are two things present in bio concrete the special bacteria belongs to genus bacillus are fulfilling the required criteria some of the list of bacteria are pseudofermis coni phila etc the chemical precursor that is used which is calcium lactate in figure number 2 the image of the bacteria can be shown it is a rod shaped structure next start with the mechanism in bio concrete if uh, water <coughs> is uh, come in contact uh, with concrete through cracks the bacteria get activated from its stage of dormancy which further in calcium carbonate which act as healing material so when the cracks completely filled by the bacteria it's again uh, going to stage of dormancy so again if in future if cracks formed this same process again started like first is contact of water then bacteria activated and then cracks filled and again the same process is going on in figure number 4 uh, there is a image in left side of the image there is a cracks uh, which is not more than 0.2 mm and in right side of the image which shows the concrete get self healed due to bacterial action as we see clearly in the image next is the reaction carried out during the process when the concrete reacts react with environmental co2 with the calcium hydroxide present in concrete the bacterial action of self healing is preferred due to active metabolic conversion of calcium nutrients to limestone by the bacteria present in the concrete like co2 plus coh ka hold twice is converted into cso3 by the use of bacteria next is how the healing agents are applied there's there's uh, two terminology in which we uh, apply the healing agent first is the direct application and second is encapsulation lwa lwa here is lightweight aggregate in direct mixing in this method bacteria and nutrient were directly embedded into concrete during its mixing stage and another one is encapsulation <coughs> in uh, encapsulation uh, in order to increase the viability of the bacteria healing agent is encapsulated into uh, tabular or ball shaped uh, capsules during mixing this encapsulation protect the bacteria from external forces uh, these capsule burst at the location of the cracks formation and hence bacteria can become active for crack healing and generally the cell concentration is uh, 10 to the power 5 cells per milliliter of water next is pros and cons of bacterial concrete first is pros pros it enhances the strength of the concrete and it decreases the permeability and water absorption ratio corrosion is also reduced and maintenance cost is a, is absolutely reduced and <coughs> another is cons there is no specified code uh, available for the construction like in rcc and steel structure codes are available uh, cost is more 
and the germination uh, here germination is the bacterial bacteria is not is died in many environment uh, and it is not suitable in all environment and the investigation is going on bacterial concrete is costly <coughs> next is case study of thondebabi in the town of uh, thondebabi outside bangalore in uh, southwestern india road connecting the small town it uh, constructed in october 2015 and uh, it is a 700 meter road 65 km from bangalore these road are more resistant to cracking road is a 100 mm thick and figure three shows uh, here is the figure which is shows the road of uh, thondebabi another case study of equador in uh, langenets uh, national park in andean highland of equador communities uh, depend on this uh, cruise canal for irrigating their field this canal made of self fill concrete so canal durability is increased these are the references thank you